Let's go. We're for each other. Let's let's go. Go. Let's go. Come on, let's go. Maison three. One, two, three. My name is uh, Warren Russ. I'm the head men's uh, soccer coach at Millsaps College. Formerly of uh, my last post was at Georgia Southwestern State University, which was a uh, Division II school down in uh, Americus, Georgia, um, playing in the Peach Belt Conference. Um, prior to that, I was at the University of Georgia for five years, working with a women's program. Um, I started coaching at uh, my alma mater at University of Central Florida, where I graduated in uh, 1989. It was my last playing season, and then uh, I worked there for a few years as well. Um, so, you know, over 20 years in college coaching and uh, I've also coached at the high school level, the club level, um, more or less just about every level. So, um, now happy to be at Millsaps. So far, everything's been great. Um, you know, I, I've only been here a month, but uh, it's been a great month. Everybody's been, you know, super friendly. Everybody made me feel welcome the first day I got here. Um, I met with the team, you know, as soon as they got here, and, and we've seemed to hit it off pretty well, you know, uh, it hasn't taken us long to get to know each other, which has been great. Um, and, uh, you know, all the guys are, you know, giving everything they can for the program. I've been pretty fortunate. Um, you know, we've got some players who returned with some experience, um, which has been good. Uh, they got a lot of experience last year. Um, we're sort of a freshman, sophomore, you know, and some junior laden team. Um, so, you know, the future is bright because they're getting more and more experience all the time. Um, we've only got, uh, we've got two seniors uh, in uh, Captain Caleb Newton and Taj Horn, and we've got a graduate student, Rob Vanderwall, um, that brings some maturity to the program, which is good. Um, you know, Caleb's been here a long time. He's seen a lot of, a lot of incarnations of Millsap soccer, and, and he's been a good resource for me. Um, and then uh, Jack Stoudy is the other captain. Who's, uh, who's a primary performer, a striker for us, um, who's also been a great resource for me in helping me get settled and, and uh, sort of instill what we're trying to do into the group. Um, you know, we've got a lot of uh, talented midfielders. Um, you know, I don't want to just list the whole team, but, um, you know, uh, Cade Folsey, and, along with Caleb Newton in midfield, Mason Boyd, um, you know, players like that, as well as, uh, you know, some freshmen and Jacob Romero and uh, Sam Cagle have come in and done a great job for us. Um, defensively, you know, we've had a big reorganization, but, uh, you know, William Ponty's done well, uh, Landon Boudreaux's done well, uh, Connor Stegman is, is getting back fit and doing well, and, and along with some of the other guys as well. Lane, uh, Lane Kirk, as a freshman, uh, has come in and, and played a lot of minutes for us. So. And he's a Mississippi guy, so we're happy for that. Um, you know, so and, and the goalkeeping's been very good. Um, um, Michael Hamway's done very, very well in, in all the games so far. So, um, you know, I, I think the future is real bright with uh, with you know the ten freshmen that we brought in. And you know, college coaching starts with recruiting. Um, so we want to recruit the kind of student athletes that that we want to be a part of our program. Um, obviously, we want good players, but we're also looking for good people. You know, we really. We want to recruit character, you know, uh, on the field and off. You know, that's very important to me. I don't believe your program can be successful even if you're winning games, if you're not doing everything right on the field and off the field, you know, and, and representing the program all the time in a manner which it deserved and, and representing the university in the same way. Um, so, you know, the first thing we're looking for is obviously, you know, a player catches your eye because they have talent. Um, and then we want to get to know them and, and we want to find out if they're a good fit for for Millsaps and for, for me and for the group, you know, do they fit into what we're trying to do? Um, and, uh, and we go from there, you know, and, and I think the recruitment process is very, very important uh, with regards to long-term goals because we need to have players that can come in and can develop and that have the aptitude and the willingness to get better. Um, and, uh, you know, if you don't have that that willingness to practice and improve, you know, you're probably not going to be a good fit for us. But um, you know, those are the things that we're really looking for, and, and you know, and um, you know where we're headed. Um, I think the future is pretty bright. You know, moving forward, um, you know, we've got long-term goals and we've got short-term goals. You know, obviously, we want to have a winning record as soon as we can. You know, that's that's evaded the program here recently. Um, you know, where we'll end up, we don't know, but that's certainly you know a primary goal for us is is to. Uh, to break that 500 mark and, and set ourselves up to move forward within our league. Um, we obviously want to finish in the top half of our league. 
you know, as quickly as we can. You know, those are goals that we're looking to achieve. This season, I'm really looking forward to, since my last season, just playing like I have nothing else to lose, really, and just being with my teammates every day and winning some games. I think as an athlete with and any aspect of life where you're going through tough times, I think it comes, it it's better to deal with them, not by focusing on the big picture, but every day and changing little things to make life easier. And then that adds up to the big picture changing in the end, in which we all uplift each other and we all can look at each other if we're going through tough times on or off the field and talk to anyone and just basically be another family outside of the one that they already have.